Hey guys, in today's video I've decided to um, film a haul video, a nail supply haul video. Um, I found myself buying a lot of things on AliExpress, eBay, Amazon and um, they're really nice good quality products. So I've decided to show you guys everything and link it down in the description. First thing I got are these butterfly plastic thingies. Um, I've seen that they've become very trendy, you see a lot of butterflies on nails so I thought I get some so both of them are different colors and they're really cute and petite um and yeah it'll be really good for um acrylics or gels but yeah this is what it looks like the next thing i got is a bunch of nail tabs um since i have a press on nail business these come very handy um, if you want to wear press on nails just for one day, these are amazing. I use them very often to take my um, content for my Instagram, so these are a must. <laughs> Since the butterflies were so trendy, I ended up getting even more. Um, I love the blue, so um, I got a bit more blue. The very Everything here is very cheap, one pound, two pounds. Um, I don't think I have anything above three pounds I believe um at least from the nail art stuff but yeah these are really cute the next thing I got are these Louis Vuitton Gucci branded nail foils if I just show you what they look like so you've got Dior Chanel Louis Vuitton um and yeah just a bunch of those um when it comes to these branded um stickers or nail fo uh, foils um can't actually get them very easily you have to be really lucky and find them on Aliexpress when they're up and quickly purchase them um, because I don't think they're actually allowed to sell these um, I didn't actually realize so I, I purchased a few branded stickers and nail files and later when I wanted to order more they were gone and I was, I was a bit confused but I did research apparently they're not actually allowed to sell them so I didn't actually know um, but yeah Really cute and handy. When we're on the topic of um, branded nail foils, I got a bunch of um, branded stickers. I was shocked when these came. The quality of these are amazing. Of course, not all of them are branded. Um, it's a bit of a mixture. A lot of Chanel, Dior, um, Louis Vuitton, Fendi. What else have we got? We've got some Playboy. Um, what else? The Supreme. Yeah, just a bunch. Prada. These are honestly, I love these. If I could and they were still up, I would buy more. As you can see, they did for a bit of um, Barbies and Mickey Mouse and stuff like that. So there is a bunch of um, random ones. But um, these are amazing. These were a bit more pricey, I want to say. I don't know. I think, I think this is two batches. Um, but let's say half of this. And I think I paid like three pounds or two. So it's amazing. I think it's amazing. There's so even on one one little sheet you get so many stickers. The quality is amazing. I love these. I love. The next two things are some gold flakes and some silver flakes. I've also realized they're very popular on nails recently. So um, I went ahead and I got some. Um, these are from Born Pretty. These are also from AliExpress. So the majority if not actually all of them, all of the nail art stuff are from AliExpress. So if the links are still available, I will link everything down below. So keep an eye out on those. Since Christmas is around the corner, I've got that pixie dust thing that, that you use to um, create sweater looks. Um, if I show you a set of nails that I did with this, for example, this set of nails as you can see, I did that sweater look vibe going on. Um, I used on the heart and the snowflake here too. So it's actually this little dust thing you use. You can use a variety of things. You can use acrylic powders, um, anything really that will do the job. But I thought I will buy the standard thing you're meant to use. Because originally I used to use acrylic powder, but now I've got the real stuff. The next two things I got were actually these little chains um my favorite i follow a lot of nail businesses um and so my favorite ones use these in between crystals so if you do 
one whole nail full of crystals. They like put this in between the crystals and it made it look so cute, took it to the next level and I loved it. So I decided to um, purchase a few myself. I haven't used them yet, but um, I can't wait to use them. These are the next two things. Um, so the very, very tiny little um, rose gold and silver balls. So I also realized that a lot of my favorite nail techs or press on nail businesses um, use these in where they place, use these where they place the crystals. So where they put the crystal around it just to fill up the little gaps, they use the, these little um, balls. So I thought I'll give it a go. I haven't got a lot of water decals, so I decided to purchase these. Um, I do, I love flowers, I love roses, so I purchased a bunch of um, rose flower water decals. So what you do with a water decal is you cut it out, you cut out which design you want, put it in the water for about a few seconds, you take it out and you can, you can literally with your finger slide the design off, which is amazing. So I got, so I got a bunch of these, really cute. Some of them of course are a bit more, you know, as if they're just drawn, some of them are a bit more realistic. But it's nice that they give you a variety and you don't have to just buy one sheet at a time. Amazing. Since I'm a press on nail business, I did purchase some press on nails. The press on nails that I use are from Macart. Um, they're very good quality and you can actually get some on AliExpress for a very good price. So I purchased um, the semi-long coffin shape. And I also purchased a short coffin shape from AliExpress. Right, I'll move this out of the way for a second because the big things are about to come up. So, the next thing I bought is this box. I love crystals. It's my favorite when it comes to doing nails. The moment I get to do, I get to put crystals on nails, I am more than happy. Um, so, as you can imagine, I have a lot of crystals since I love them so much, but I would always keep them in a little bag. They would come or you know, sometimes they would come in this and I'll just hold so many of these everywhere. Um, but I came across these boxes, so I thought I'll purchase them. As you can see, I already put my crystals inside. All of these crystals are from AliExpress as well. So um, there is a lot of links, but if there's any specific one of these that you would like me to link up, please leave it in the comments below and I will go searching for it. Um, I will link it down below or reply to comment with the link, but it's really cool. So um, you can actually take each individual row out and open each individual one. So it's amazing. I love it so much. This is my, this was the first one I got and I actually ended up getting another one <laughs> for more crystals, of course. And I, I don't know if I'm not gonna buy another one because I'm, I'm still running out. Even things like these, so rather than having like a lot of these run everywhere, you can put this, these into these pots and then you can just store it all together into these little boxes. Right, now we can look into gel polishes. So the first three that I got are from Blue Sky and these are from eBay actually. Um, I think Blue Sky is a really good company for the price. These are the colours I got. Very cute, very very good polishes, they even out very nicely, no problems with these. Love them, but of course they're a bit more on the pricier side. These are about six, seven pounds on eBay. And the next polishes I got were actually from AliExpress and it's from this company called Vinaliza. Um, they are actually amazing. I was shocked. They're about one pound fifty, two pound for each. However, they're amazing. This one is 7.5 milliliters and actually the Blue Sky R10. So you get a bit more for the price, but these are amazing. They are very pigmented. These are all the colors I got. And it's actually quite nice that they also show you the bottle is the, the color of the gel inside. And same with the Blue Sky, they have that at the top, but some gel polishes don't have anything and it's so frustrating. You can't see what's inside. But yeah, these are amazing, very pigmented. They also even out very nicely. Um, no issues with them, paint amazing. Yeah, I really recommend for the price, I mean, amazing. I would even compare them to as good as Blue Sky. And the very last thing I got was actually 
of course, like I mentioned before, I am an, a press on nail business. And as you can imagine, I do a lot of press on nails and I don't just send them to customers. I also do it for myself, for my family members, for friends. And I find myself just ended up having a lot of press on nails that I've made for myself, just laying around on the strips somewhere, just in drawers, mixed up, falling apart. So I actually came across a really, really, really handy little box, which I believe I got on eBay. So it looks like this, it has little drawers. Let me just take you off the stand quickly. All right, so it comes in this little cute box. Um, and it originally had a black um, sheet underneath, but I decided to take it off. I feel like it looks cuter this way. But yeah, you can hold all of your press on nails inside. As you can see, this is the one I just took out to show you. But yeah, all, all of them, of course, like for example, the blue one and the red ones, they're both a bit too long, so they kind of overlap each other. But the majority of them, as you can see, fit in there. I think it's amazing. And since this one's full already, and since this one is full already, I did buy another one. And it's really cool because as you can see, you've got little dents at the top. And so it, so does this, but underneath. So when you place it on top, it just fits perfectly as if it's just meant to be like this. As you can see through here, they just clip on pretty much. And yeah, and you can have two layers and it's honestly the best thing I've probably purchased in this haul. <laughs> I haven't purchased it now. However, I didn't want to mention this matte top coat. I know a lot of people are struggling with matte top coats. That they're, they're streaky. Um, they don't leave your nails looking amazing. This one also from Venelisa, I got on AliExpress as well. And it's actually amazing. I've, I've honestly really rarely have any issues with streaks. It's it's honestly perfect. I wouldn't change it for anything else. I'm honestly like, I'm sure there's much better even than this one out there. However, if you are on the budget and you do want to make matte press on nails and your, or just normal nails, and you are struggling with a matte top coat, this one is the, the one to go with. It is about £2.50. However, you do get 12 mils inside. So that one is a steal. And the last thing that I did get are these poly gels. Let me show you. Just push that out the way. I've heard about poly gels and I have a few of myself, but I've never came across pigmented, as much as these are at least, poly gels. I came across clear, um, whites, nude colors, baby pinky colors, but they're all very sheer and very neutral. These, however, are pigmented um, and they, you could almost say that they would work like an acrylic. Um, so just like an acrylic, they're coloured, you won't need anything else. It appears like this is what they're trying to achieve with poly gel as well, which is amazing. Um, so I picked up these. Let's have a look how pigmented they are. Oh wow. Oh yeah. Very blue, very baby blue. Um, here we've got Addict. Let's have a look at this one since it's very dark. Oh yeah, look how dark that is. Amazing, so pigmented, I'm shocked. Honestly, wow. What else do we have? Let's look at the diamond. Let's see if it's very, very glittery or just sheer glitter. Oh wow, look at that. That's amazing, it's full of glitter, whoa. That's crazy. Wow, I can't wait to try them, wow. Okay. Um, so of course with all poly gels you do need a slip solution. I I didn't purchase any, but I do have some, so I'll just show you what it looks like. It comes in a little bottle like this. Slip solution, um, builder poly gel, now liquid. So this is all you need to work with these poly gels, which is also amazing. Let me know if you'd like me to um, create a video on how to use these and how they perform and if it's easy or not. Yeah, let me know. These are amazing. And oh, you, you, and you also get a lot in these bottles. Um, does it actually spit thirty grams? Very, very, very big. So, so yeah, I think that will that will conclude our nail supply haul. Thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. 
comment what you'd like me to do in the, ne in the next videos down in the description. And I will see you guys in the next video.